Excuse me, I... have you ever been in Schenectady? No, I never was in Schenectady. Neither have I. Must have been a couple of other guys. But I still have a feeling I've seen your face. Please. Someplace else. No, it's always been right here. Right on top of my neck. Maybe you've seen me on television. Oh, oh no, I've never been on television. <laughs> See, is, is it all? Oh, all right. If I, if, if, if I join you, I, I just dropped in for a little drink to settle my nerves before I go to work. Work. <laughs> what, what, what sort of work do you do? I'm an airline, airline pilot. <laughs> get to be an airline pilot. I used, I used to be a bus. I used to be a bus driver. But I, I quit. Too, too many, too many drunks on the road. What do you fly? Of course, one of those big, big gray, gray metal things with what you call it sticking out on the side. Wings? Oh, you in here, Lab Brother? No, but I'm, I've been pretty high in my time. Did you ever have any close calls as a pilot? Oh, yes, sir. Especially since they moved the men's room to the back of the plane. I was on a, a flight from New York to L.A. a couple weeks ago, and the plane lost an engine. Oh, don't worry. It'll turn up. You know... There's a lot, lot of pre pressure being a pilot, flying way up there, and high in the air, and all above all those white, fl fluffy things. Clouds? You sure you're not a pilot? You know, at the same time, time it, it's, a, it's quite a sobering thought and a very inspiring fe feeling to realize that there are hundreds, hundreds of people on my plane all depending on me. <laughs> and to that, I, I happen to hold, hold their lives right in the palm, palm of my hand. <laughs> Because I'm flying a 74. I'm flying a 747 to L London tonight, and the plane is scheduled to leave uh, precisely one hour and 43 minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs> See you. 